So I was about to take a picture of an important tin bridge when Rick says to me, Jerry, never mind that. Get over here. There's a water buffalo about to give birth. So I got the, uh, the gaffers and the sound crew, and we quickly focused all the attention over on Bessie. I've never been on a TDA tour before where there was a live birth. Um, uh, it's happened that people have met and uh, had babies afterwards. Um, maybe on some of the longer tours, if we'd driven off when the hooves were just out, uh, that would have been possible. For instance, on the South American tour, it's five and a half months, so that's enough time to make like a, a half a baby. Uh, but um, I've been told that it uh, doesn't work that way. Gotta say, I've never seen such a violent birth. Bessie seemed to be having troubles, and then all of a sudden, she twists around like Nadia Comaneci on the uneven bars in the 1976 Olympics and hurls this baby right into a mud patch. It didn't take long before some of the local water buffalo dignitaries came around with frankincense and myrrh. People have already come up to me and asked me, what have you learned from this? And what I've learned from this is that this seemed like a pretty straightforward and uncomplicated thing. And maybe there's some lessons that we could apply and, and save some money in our health services at, at home. For instance, uh, why, why do we lie down for this stuff? Why, and if that's the case, why do we even need uh, beds? I mean, maybe something like a, if we threw like a hula hoop into the picture, we could we could save some money. I'm, I'm just I'm just thinking out loud. And what about the baby itself? I mean, we were pissed off because we we're standing here half an hour. We wanted to get to lunch, and we were waiting for this calf to start walking. I mean, I've had three kids. It took them like 10 months. I mean, maybe it, you've got to reassess this whole like hovering parent thing. I mean, no kids don't lose on the soccer pitch anymore. There's only second winners. I'm, I just think maybe we got to take another look. Look, I think there may be some lessons here. Here, I, I'm, I'm just one guy and uh, I will confess, I'm not that well versed in this uh, thing they call, um, uh, you know, uh, science. <laughs>